All right, open enrollment in Medicare just began, and for those of you who are looking into it for the first time, it can be confusing. To help navigate some of that, Dr. Michael Schuf with CHI Health joins us live. Thanks for being here, doctor. Happy to do it. All right, so open enrollment started the 15th. That's what, 11 days ago. What are the basics that people need to know? Well, so it's important that everybody who currently has Medicare or those who are now eligible but haven't enrolled before enroll during this time. So we have between October 15th and December 7th to review your Medicare plan and enroll in whatever plan you want for the next year. If you're turning 65, you've got an opportunity starting three months before your birthday and three months after to register as well. Okay, so what are the different plans and what should folks look for? Yeah, so, so the, as you look at Medicare, they've got different parts. Part A is for your hospital insurance. If you end up in the hospital, part B is your insurance for outpatient things, seeing your doctor in a clinic, lab work, those sorts of things. Part C is the Medicare Advantage plans. I'll talk about that in just a sec. Part D is the prescription drug coverage. So traditional Medicare is parts A and B, the hospital and the clinic. And then you can buy a, a Medigap policy that covers some other things that Medicare doesn't traditionally cover. And then Medicare Advantage are commercial insurance plans that work with Medicare and offer the hospital, the outpatient, the pharmacy benefit, and then oftentimes other things like vision and dental coverage as well. And it's important to look at those because they do have a quite a variety of, of things that they offer at various price points. So you can choose what you want, what you would actually need, what you don't need, those sorts of things if you're looking at a Medicare Advantage plan. What about those viewers who are just turning 65? I mean, this sounds like it can be different than employee-sponsored health care. Certainly, and, and you've got a lot more choice. Your employer typically picks one or two plans you can choose from. So with Medicare, you want to look at several things. The key is you want to look at what is my health status now? What are my health needs now? What do, who am I seeing? So, so checking the network of these plans. What providers, what hospitals do they allow you to go to at their included price versus at a higher premium price? or not coverage at all. So if you have a primary care provider you see, make sure they're in network with you. Look at the cost of your medications, make sure they're covered as well. Consider other needs that you need. And you can do that, there's various services like at medicare.gov, type in your zip code, type in the medicines you take, and they can help you select plans and look at the pricing options for them. And is there a navigator you can work with? Is there, is there a person you can go to to say, what's the best plan for me? Yeah, so there's several options there. On our website, chahelp.com slash Medicare, you can learn more about it. You can find various resources. I mentioned medicare.gov. They've got lots of things there and phone numbers you can call for people already on Medicare, especially with an Advantage plan. Calling the phone number or going to the website on the back of your card can give you a lot of help. And there are independent brokers you can find, too, to help you talk through options for you. Dr. Michael Schoff with CHI Health, thanks so much for all that information today.